Hi friend, whether you are new to Azure Load Balancer, new to Application Gateway, new to a Traffic Manager, or even you are new to Azure, doesn't matter. In my videos, I explain concepts step by step like this with the help of diagrams. Because remembering and understanding the visuals is 100 times better than theory, right? So be ready because by the end of this video, you can confidently explain these concepts to anyone when to use Azure Load Balancer, Application Gateway, when to use Traffic Manager, anything. And yes, this is a very important from interview point of view. So be ready. Let's start. What is the role of Azure Load Balancer? Be ready. You are going to hear the best answer. Let's say you are a developer and you set up your Azure cloud for your company with a few virtual machines, front end, back end and your database running on them. OK, now, as I explained earlier, also when more users will come visit your website uh, hosted in virtual machines or app service, you can add more VMs like this to handle the extra loads. OK by using the horizontal scaling concept which i explained earlier but here is the question how will the incoming traffic from the users on the internet will be shared between all these uh, front-end servers for that you can use azure load balancer like this okay azure load balancer acts like a traffic police officer or a traffic light all uh, requests are coming on Azure Load Balancer and Azure Load Balancer will check okay five requests and there five requests and there equally it will evenly or equally it will distribute the request making sure that one VM is not overloaded okay so here is the simple and easy definition Azure Load Balancer distributes incoming tra traffic across multiple virtual machine to ensure high availability scalability and fault tolerance okay and this definition in this book will help you in revision from the book later and yes there is one another concept also that is application gateway which is very much similar to load balancer but that i will explain in another question what actually it is what is the role of azure application gateway so look at this diagram this is the Azure Application Gateway diagram. In here, I already explained Azure Load Balancer, which is used to evenly or equally distribute the incoming request to the virtual machines, right? But here we are using Application Gateway. And it's very much at, at the same position where the load balancer it. So what is the difference? Okay. So if you remember, the load balancer distributes evenly between VMs so that no single VM will be overloaded, right? Whereas application gateway distribute tra uh, traffic based on the rules, rules. For example, inside application gateway, you can define a rule that all HTTP requests will go to VM one and HTTPS request go to VM two. So these kinds of rules you can define inside the application gateway. Okay. So application gateway is rule specific load balancer is basically traffic specific you do not have to define any rule for traffic balancer okay here is the simple definition azure application gateway distributes and route incoming traffic to various app to your application based on various rules example http this is just an example there can be any rules you can define for your application gateway okay so if it is clear to you, then write crystal clear in the comment or chat box to boost your confidence so that you remember this answer forever. Quick update before the next question. I cracked as your interview after facing many rejections. From that experience, I created this complete as your interview course. This course include five things. Number five. 200 interview questions, all topics step by step, even if you are an Azure beginner. Fourth, real scenario based questions, just like in real interviews. Third, you can check your interview preparation status by marking questions prepared or not prepared. 
second is this pdf book for quick revision and first is as your top 10 mock interviews many student cracked interviews using my courses you can be the next course and book links are given in the description if you are interested great if not no worries let's continue with the next question how to use load balancer and application gateway together in azure now listening the uh, after listening the answer i will become your favorite okay so just kidding let me explain this with the help of a diagram here are the virtual machines where you know applications your application one application is running and it's a very big application that's why we need so many virtual machines to host it for you know catering many many millions of users now in a real world scenario when multiple users are trying to access your application through a browser first we will play a application gateway to receive all these incoming requests okay and we will put some rule inside it for example as per the rule the application gateway will distribute the traffic based on http and https so http will go to load balancer 1 and https requests will go to load balancer 2 okay all http will load balancer 1 now the uh, so that is now to improve the performance here we added the load balancer after the application gateway now load balancer will distribute the uh, one will distribute the traffic to vm1 and vm2 so these are for http and vm3 vm4 will be catering https okay because load balancer is only sending the http requests uh, oh, sorry based on the rule okay so application uh, so this is how both application gateway first and load balancer next will together work in a real world as your setup you cannot put the uh, load balancer first because it will uh, will not check that whether it is http https it will evenly distribute so that's not the good idea for put the application gateway we have to put first see for a small uh, applications few users you need not to put the load balancer that is not requirement because if you will put load balancer that load balancer from azure will cost you something azure will charge you in the billing okay it's for big applications only okay here is the summarized answer yes in real world applications azure application gateway and load balancer can be used together typically application gateway is pl placed in front of the load balancer that's it you want to route request on url path what as your service feed you know the answer don't say me that you don't know okay i already explained this you are not listening then pause think done use as your application gateway with path based routing it can redirect request to different backend poles based on the url segments okay so that is a very good answer or you can use as your front door also that is all in one okay front door but is very but this is specific to this question as your application gateway is the 100 percent matching answer front door is way better and it has no it's it has many more features and it is very costly also so okay what is azure traffic manager how does it manage global traffic so let me give you again a very simple example suppose you are working as a lead developer in a big company like amazon or microsoft and your application is hosted globally in the cloud okay for example you have in the azure you have two sets of uh, vms one is present in the region one which is new york i already explained regions availability zones in the previous questions there we have two vms and we have another vm uh, another uh, region mumbai where we have vm3 and vm4 the same application is hosted in both of these regions and vms okay now you want when the users are sending the request for example from near usa resources you want the users to come to this uh, hit this region okay and from india users you want the users to hit the request to this mumbai region uh, uh, app, uh, virtual machine applications okay so for that 
you will use azure traffic manager where the request will come and it will distribute the request to region one if there is any load balancer you can use it same way load balancer 2 and then the load balancer will distribute further so, so what azure um, traffic manager is doing it is sending the usa request to the new york region and the india users to the mumbai region okay and yes one more thing you can here you can use load balancer application gateways together okay here you can use application gateway also so that's up to you so that is the full picture of the azure traffic manager and here is the simple and easy to remember definition azure traffic manager distribute user traffic across multiple azure regions improve availability performance and disaster recovery and uh, writing this definition into the book so that later you can easily revise it if it is clear to you write crystal clear in the comment or chat box to boost your confidence great job my friend now if you understand these concepts then there is one more very important related concept and that is azure front door which is very important from interview point of view that i have explained in my complete azure interview course using very simple and easy to understand visual many of my students have already used my courses to crack their interviews so if you are also serious about cracking your next azure interview and do not want to miss a single question then check out this course link and the pdf book link in the description below